in my uh, research group which is known as the materials research group so we are looking at the applications of both polymers and nanomaterials towards applications such as energy storage devices which is which is battery and everyone is using battery nowadays and you must be aware how lithium ion batteries are facing lots of problem both in terms of energy de density and the uh, fire uh, fire problems which are occurring quite simultaneously with this so in my research group we are thinking beyond lithium ion battery so in this direction we are looking at uh, uh, some cathode materials which are derived from waste. So we are looking at the green chemistry perspective because as you are, are aware, like petroleum sources, their prices are increasing day by day. Second thing, uh, besides this, like there is lots of this uh, non-biodegradable waste which is accumulating like big, big piles or mountains, we can say. So in that aspect, we are utilizing these waste so that it can go into some good applications. So it's waste out of waste we are getting some good applications so in this uh, we are utilizing one of the phenolic rich material which is cardenol and india is rich in cashew nut industry so we are utilizing this cardenol and another waste which we are utilizing is sulfur which is generated in like huge several tonnage every year from the petroleum industries including india so this sulfur has got not much application apart from vulcanization but we are looking the application in the reverse way we are using this sulfur and this cardinal waste and the new application which has come out is lithium sulfur battery so this is beyond lithium ion battery so they have got high theoretical capacity and not much problems associated so far with the uh, flame resistant problems so that a sort of aspect which we are looking in our research group towards energy storage devices